K-I-L-R Killer Games Fun, fun. We are going. To, I, I'm, I'm already feeling chills going up my Spine. arms. Look at that! I got Whoa. goosebumps. That. <laughs> that's why I wear jackets. Ugh, it's wicked. See what this game does. <laughs> All right, so we're going to continue. Continue previously playing game. Yes. Nah. All right. This sounds inventory. very creepy. I inventory is uh, tab. Tab. Forget all of our moves here. It is filled with acid. Uh, Fill up no. your lantern with the oil. Left, right, in the middle part. Oh. Not that one. That one. That not that one. That one. Double click it. Okay. And then just do it again. A medical bracer to improve health and help heal. I have to remember that. Um, now, if we double click this, we're not going to like drink it or something, are we? No. Do we just select it or do we actually double click it? Double click it. Okay. Then I guess we just put it right on there. Yep. Alright. Good deal. I forget. How do we crouch like that? Okay. Be sure you remember how to run. Isn't that uh shift? Yeah. Okay. And lantern was L, wasn't it? It was F. Was it F? Okay. M is mementos, J is journal. Jumping is not it. <laughs> Became impossible to avoid. And that's all we read. Their voices were silenced. dark in here. Yes, and there's a good reason for it. But you can light the lamp now if you wish. What's the reason for the darkness, that is? Stay close. Be careful not to stray. What's the reason? Why is it so dark? Pay attention, Dandel. It's important that you keep going straight and make sure not to stray. Your sanity is going. Yeah, no. Is that me just hearing things? Probs. Oh, well, that's nice. Does it mean 
me or am I hearing something? It's a dog whining with pain. Just a usual everyday thing. be okay lighting this thing over here? What if the monster comes? Can we just hide in the dark over there? I guess we could. At least it gives us a little bit of area of sanity here. be hours. I think the monster is that way. Oh, that's a lot better. Keep wondering if we're missing something around here. Well, so far there's three doors. That one, that one, and one behind us. Not that one. Oh, there's one back over here? Yeah. Oh yeah, there is. I'd close the door behind you. Just in case. Your sanity is really low. That looked cool. <laughs> that was kind of freaky. Alright, there's gotta be a, a place here we can light something. Uh, like that. Click tab. Tab? Yeah. Your sanity is dot O. Oh. I was gonna say it's triple dot. Oh. <laughs> my hand head is pounding and my hands are shaking. Oh, okay, that doesn't do anything. There's a hammer, maybe I can throw a hammer at the uh, monster. Or you can board up the door. Always check behind barrels. Sometimes there's like stuff hidden. Lantern. Hmm. Maybe those ones over there. Not. 
Well, we came through that one. So, so let's not go through that one. Why is there... I hear the dog over here. I hear the dog everywhere. Should we don't even want to take a peek? Mm. I can't see anything. Oh. Mind your way? <laughs> no, I mean like it's all dark. hearing this noise, I'm like, what are you doing? I'm not doing anything. Okay, it's just another room. Lantern. How are we doing? Okay, we, it looks like we got plenty of uh, oil and stuff. Easily. Ugh. Don't read the note. Oops. Monster didn't like it. Twenty second of June, eighteen thirty nine. It's been more than a month since my last entry. After the event inside the underground chamber in Algeria, Professor Herbert insisted I return to England. He said he didn't want to risk forfeiting the entire expedition lest I took a turn for the worse. An excessive decision, in retrospect. But I'm glad it turned out that way. I found my journal this morning in the haphazard collection of things brought home from Africa. Next to it, lay the broken stone orb wrapped in cloth. I tried to assemble it, but couldn't. The pieces wouldn't fit together, as if they weren't from the same object. Could I have imagined it all? Was there ever a complete orb? Is that? I don't know. It's kind of what I was wondering. It's a piece of cloth. Oh, it's a pulsing. Uh, it's a. What? What is yeah. that? <laughs> <laughs> don't like hurt yourself. Sheesh. I'm gonna pull a muscle in my neck. that door. Oh, move the boxes! I was about ready to do that. Not that box, though. I remember this part. This was from the demo. Huh. We put a 
box there. Maybe he won't. If there is a monster, maybe we'll go through there. <laughs> Aha! <laughs> Silly box. I didn't like that. No. <laughs> Apparently it didn't. Wait, grab the thingy. Yeah, I was going to, but I was just gonna... Oh. I can't. Crouch. Oh. You can go in the thing. Yeah, I know, but we have some other doors we haven't gone through mm. yet. There's too many doors. Well, you never know, there might be a clue or something. Oh, that leads out to there. Yeah, we've been in here already. So then that door connects to that room, which is connected to that door. So which way did we come from? We came from that way. From this way? Yeah. So have we come... Have we gone through that door? No. That door wasn't open before. Oh, nice. At least not that wide. Well, we know that should go back around over there. Yeah. Seriously, it looks like a trap. What does? This room. Why? Because look at it, it's so secluded. Look, a note. Oh. <laughs> 25th of June, 1839. I feel the need to continue this journal, even though it was intended for my journey to Africa. This must be something I don't want it to very end. important. I just know it. I've taken it upon myself to piece the orb back together, but it's been more difficult than one might think. The pieces are behaving strangely. They seem to change color, shape, and texture, but ever so slightly. Yesterday, I took careful measurements and notated any significant markings. Today, I confirmed my suspicions. They were changing. I was terrified and rushed off to see the finest geologist in London, Sir William Smith. I approached the subject with care and we discussed how rocks change form. He told me That's cool. about the nature of glass, how it eventually collapses on itself, like ice slowly melting over the course of centuries. Smith eased Don't my mind dare. a bit, but I can't escape the feeling that these shards have Run. otherworldly properties. Or what? I don't know, a monster broke through a door of some kind. I thought it was our door. 
Oh, your sanity's dot, dot, dot. I'm in the light, though. That doesn't do anything. You have to progress fast. I thought I was progressing. Not fast enough. No! Should we go into this door? That's the same room. Oh, it is? Yeah. Okay. Oh, there's an oil thing. Where's the oil thing at? Back there. Next to the box. Don't stand on the squishy things. Huh. Use the ladder, 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 ladder. This? Yeah, it'll help heal yourself. Oh. I guess I am. If you get hurt one more time, I think you die. Do I? No, you don't. Well, there's something up there. Up there? No. Other way. Up there. looking at the rest of the room. There's this. It's a trap door. A trap? Or an opening. would be gone by now. Sounds awfully loud. <laughs> ah.
press M. Oh, that's right. Something is clogging the pulley. Oh, I that th it's up there. That thing. Maybe get a box. And then, like, stand on top of it. Oh, I mean, that's what I was thinking. I might want to bring it back a little bit. Well, if you can't reach it. that there was a lamp or something over here. Especially with that thing sitting there. Now there is these, there's a door there. That goes out to that other room. Oh, okay. Where we came from. So it sounds like we want to go down there. Yeah. There's a red thing, though. Just go fast. Crouch. Do we have to jump that? Just go in. fill this up anymore. It's empty. Is it? Wow. Oh, I had a little bit of oil. Oh, with a few drops. Okay. Well, that was good. Now it's empty. We won't be going back that way. As soon as you see water, jump on top of that box on your left. That one right there? Yeah, like run to it. Run to it. You will want to get out of the water, like right now. There are invisible water monsters. As soon as you go in the water, it will run to you and kill you. Great. So... I do know how to get past this part. It's in the demo. Oh, 
I'm going to assume I'm going to have to jump from here to there. Yeah, and, and you have to go there. in that side room. You have to go in there? Yeah. Is there any spot where the water's not touching? No, you'll have to run. There's a box there, though. not going to be able to see what's around the corner. I do see some boxes though. So basically I need to kind of run and jump up on that box. Yeah, like like as fast as possible. For all I know that monster could be like right in front of me. It's to the side of you. Oh nice. Do I have to crouch to get in there or no? Do you, what? Do I have to crouch to get in there? No. Oh. Alrighty. Let's do this. Crap. You can distract it with the book. Yeah, like if you throw it away. Ow. You're in the water. I was on the box. Use your Latin Adam. Latin. Latin. Barely conscious. Do I need it? Because it's all red or? If you want to live. Because if you get attacked one more time, you're dead. I do know how to get out, but I can let you figure it out if you want. Yeah, I can figure it out. It'll be hard. You can right-click to throw. Something. Won't last long though. Thing is, is I don't even know what it's doing. It's not in that room. Can't pull it down, whatever it is. Well, I suppose I can try to jump from this box. Ah. Interesting. running before it closes
Well, I got in here. Doesn't look I'm gonna have like much life left. Crap. <laughs> Dead flesh can act as a distraction. I was trying to jump up on that box. It wouldn't let me. It's too high. But those things give hints. Ah, dead flesh can be used. Got it. But I can't reach it. Get a little closer. Or run, like, sprint and jump at the same time. Oh, that's what I tried to do. Did you sprint and jump? I thought I did. While being on the box? got here. Something that way. I have no idea. Looks like a couple of chests or something over there. They're just barrels. This now that I'm looking, it looks like one big room, and that's the hallway. So I guess we throw it over there. We'll run that direction. Does that sound like a plan? Sounds like a plan. Alright. Great! He went way back over there. Because it's getting the food. Doesn't that sound lovely? That sounds great. That will be us. It already was us. Um. I'm gonna assume. Does that open that thing? Yes. All right. You're gonna have to spin it. I can give you a hint, boxes can move. Good idea. It just pushed it away. Actually, I pushed it closer. That might actually work, assuming we don't fall off of it. Oh, thank goodness.
The door will open. Other way. Crap. Oops. You're going the wrong way. Go, just run. Crap. Okay, stop moving. <laughs> My goodness. Uh. Save it. Just keep going fast. Should we... Should we try to find anything over there? There isn't. The question is, can we make it up to that box? Why didn't you just jump on it? I tried. No, I mean like, instead of running back, just run, jump up to it. I tried to jump on it and I got turned around. Maybe find a book? Well, those ones aren't. Oh. But on the other bookshelf, there are. Over there? That means I uh -huh. have to jump over to... Wait a minute. I can pick up that box. Yeah, you can throw the box. I was thinking I could just make another... It'll probably push it. monsters these days. Something tells me I'm not going to be able to stand on that. I'm thinking maybe I should have moved that box. It's oh, locked. that's what the hollow needle is for. Ah. You can use those to break simple locks. Now try. He pushed himself above the surface. Help! Water. You're gonna wanna run through this entire thing. Doors open towards you. All the time. Music is racing. Yeah, I can hear that.
<laughs> well, your wish came true. The lacquered hull of SS Hortensia glittered in the soothing warm yellow light of the setting sun. Dream. Dream, another dream. Uh, no uh, more water. Good. Oh, the music sounds better. Well, I think this is... I was going to try to do it back there, but I think this is actually a good place for us to... Sleep. Sleep. Take a breather. Enjoy the light. Music. And the music. And the dry ground. Yes, the dry ground. Wow. Alright, well, thanks everyone for watching us, because we... We got owned. <laughs> <laughs> we got owned by squishy things that like to kill people. Yeah. Got slashed several times. Um, but yeah. Uh, f f uh, I, I don't know if I would say fun, freaky, freaky times. There we go. Anyway, uh, be sure to check out the other videos that we've got because some are freaky and some scary. Some are just bizarre scary that you know so bizarre that they are scary and some are just made by freaky people and so, some are just facepalm yeah some other some of just that but anyway just go ahead and just click any one of those uh, uh, videos that you see there and you can see some of our other stuff and uh, we'd like that especially if you click thumbs up and let us know that you like it anyway we will see you on whatever video that you decide to watch next. Hope you'll watch the next part of this one as we stumble around and get eaten by wall monsters is what I'm guessing is next. I don't know. <laughs> Alrighty, take care.